Hello, my dear friends. Although the cherry blossom petals have already turned into pink spring green, lightly floating to people's hearts, I still want to write down the pink love letter for the beautiful flowers. At the same time, I want to send this article to a special friend who likes cherry blossoms. As much as I do, tell him the story of me and Sakla. The reason why I wrote this article, in fact, it has a big relevance with his friend. In the early morning of first of April, I had a dream. In my dream, I was flying to Indonesia. To visit one of my good friends, Wanda. After landing, I found a beautiful book in the airport bookstore. This book is a photo album about cherry blossom, which introduces all different shapes of cherry blossom all over Japan. As I read through the book, I thought how wonderful it would be. If my friend could read it too, he's gonna love it. Next to me, a passenger on the same flight opened another book. My attention was attracted by that book. That is a book about a Japanese samurai named Minamoto no Yulimasa. I remember very well. I told the passenger in my dream, "I know this samurai. He must be a relative of Minamoto Yulitomo and one of the Game family." At that time, there were two big samurai clans: the Pain and the Game. After fight with each other several times, the Game won, and. Minamoto Yulitomo built Kamakura Bakufu. Minamoto Yulitomo's half brother, Minamoto Yusuke, was a very famous samurai and a very tragic figure. In the future, I will tell the story of these two people, especially Minamoto Yulitomo and his wife Hotro Masako. Minamoto Yusuke. And his concubine, Sitka Goten. When I woke up, the name Minamoto no Yulimasa seemed to be carved in my heart, so I searched for the name. Before I introduce Minamoto no Yulimasa, I want to tell you a little bit about history. As we all know, China. Is a mother of East Asian culture. The profound influence of Chinese culture on these countries can be clearly felt in Japan, Korea, Vietnam, and other countries. Since the Tang Dynasty, Japan has sent diplomats to learn from Chinese cultures. Today, Japanese still use Chinese characters. And some of the characters still retain their original Asian Chinese meanings. The Japanese kimono was first called gofuku because during the Three Kingdoms period in the late Eastern Han Dynasty of China, the Kingdom of Wu traded with Japan and introduced textiles and clothes-making methods to Japan. The Japanese tea ceremony originate from Lu Yu, the classic of tea in Tang Dynasty, and the Dian Cha technique in the Song Dynasty. In urban planning, Japan was also learning from China. In Tang Dynasty, China. Had two capital cities, namely the western capital Chang'an, today Xi'an, 
in Shanxi Province, China, and the East Capital, also the Divine Capital, Luoyang. Today's Luoyang in Henan Province, China. During the reign of Empress Wu Zetian, there were also two capital cities in Japan. One is the ancient capital Nara, formerly known as Hiyoku. The other is the spiritual home of Japan, the ancient capital of Kyoto, formerly known as Heian-kyo. It was said that the Japanese emperor moved the capital to Heian-kyo because. The evil spirits of Hiyoku, and the word Heian means peace in Chinese. Thus, began the Heian period in Japan. The Heian period was the age of the nobility. The emperor treated as the incarnation of God, but had no real power. The real power was in the hands of the nobles, led by Fujiwara, and the highest power was held by Kanbak. But by the end of the Heian period, the samurai were gaining strength. Two big samurai groups emerged: the pay and the game. Both of them were actually descended of the emperor, while they lost their real identities. Led by their leaders, Tainalo Kiyomori, the Pei defeated the Qing in Henji rebellions and almost. Wiped out all the gang family. Gang's leader Minamoto no Yoshitomo was killed in the escape, and his third son Minamoto no Yoritomo was later exiled to Izu. While his other sons, including Minamoto Yoshitine, were forced to become monks. In the temple, the pain reached the pinnacle of power. Minamoto no Yulimasa refused to join Minamoto no Yoshitomo in the political struggle, so he became the only game who still be a politician in the pain's world, and was awarded. The subordinate third-class official positions. Minamoto no Yulimasa was a legendary archer who was said to have used a bow, an arrow, and a sword to remove a legendary monster in order to protect the emperor. So he was cursed by the monster. The 77-year-old Minamoto no Yulimasa was the first to stand up for the pain, as they rose to the top and became arrogant and domineer. But he was filled. The samurai who loved poetry for all his life still not forget to create the song of esteem. In the last moment, sign I'm like a plant buried in the earth all the year around. It has already grown, but the bud has not yet opened. The cherry blossom is the flower, and the samurai is the man. Life is short, as the blink of an eye. People's life to be like the cherry blossom, gorgeous open.
many people can't understand the samurai's halakili, or even laugh at it. But it's just another manifestation of the sakura spirit. It takes less than ten days for sakura from blossom to fade. But during these ten days, every cherry blossom is trying its best to blossom and leave its best appearance in people's hearts. From ancient times to the present, Japanese samurai have gone into battlefield with one belief that they will die in the field. A short life. With a grand death, the Himalayas in China is the origin of cherry blossom. More than 2,000 years ago, in the Qin and Han dynasties, cherry blossom were planted in the Chinese royal court. In the Tang dynasty, cherry blossoms were seen everywhere, from the royal court. To the garden of normal people. When thousands of countries came to worship, Japanese diplomats brought cherry blossom back to Japan, along with Chinese characters, architecture, clothing, tea ceremony, and kanto. Cherry blossom is called sakura in Japanese. So why is it called that? This comes from Konohana Sakurahime, a goddess in the Japanese mythology of Nihon Shuki. Nini Jino Mikudo is the son of Sun Goddess Amaterasu. After he came to human world, he fell in love with the goddess Konohana Sakurahime. And their descendants become the emperor of Japan. It said that when spring comes, Konohana Sakurahime will fly from the southern to northern Japan. Her flying, like a pink mushroom, blowing from south to north. The cherry blossoms on the earth blossom in order. My love for the cherry blossoms started from the first Kona movie I watched, the seventh Kona movie, Crossroad in the Asian Capital. Beautiful Kyoto, the cherry blossoms dancing with the wind, accompanying the sun, time after time, wandering in the street of cherry blossom, sung by Kuraki Mai. From then on. I had a dream in my heart. I wished I can go to Kyoto. From the age of eleven, I have been obsessed with everything about cherry blossoms, looking for them everywhere. When I was young, cherry blossoms were not widely planted in the city where I lived in. I once mistook the purple-leaved plum flower for the cherry blossom, the same light pink, but much smaller shape. Purple-leaved plum nestle up along the road, extend forward. When I was a kid, I liked riding my bike on every road planted with purple-leaved plums. When I went to high school. I was pleasantly surprised to find that there were cherry blossom trees planted in my school. Although the cherry blossom trees were very small, I prayed every spring and kept wishing for more flowers next year. In the spring before my graduation, the cherry blossoms were particularly numerous, as if the trees. Had heard my wish. There are many places planting cherry blossom in Shanghai. I love 
wandering in the campus of Shanghai University and watching the petals dance with the wind. At the Xizang South Road station on Line 8, there has a huge cherry blossom tree. Every time I step out of the subway station, I was deeply healed by the certain sight of pink. Most people love cherry blossoms in its full blooming, but in my heart, cherry blossoms are perfect all the time. They are beautiful in bud, in bloom, and weather away. Humans are like cherry blossom, fade and bloom with the seasons. Cherry blossoms are like dreams. Our lives are also like dreams. Our lives mixture of the force and the truth. The force can be the truth and the truth can be the force. Maybe we have a chance to catch a glimpse of our past selves, or even sneak in the glimpse of our future selves. Maybe your past self has had sad memories and painful experience. Our hearts will also cry for this experience. But that doesn't mean the past is incomplete. On the contrary, when we see through the void and reality, our inner being is always whole and complete. Embrace yourself laughing, embrace yourself crying, like tenderly looking at a cherry blossom tree. No matter what she looks like, love her for what she really is. Her thousands of gestures, thousands of kinds of beauty, will be forever in our heart. That is the end of today's sharing, and I'd like to share two songs with you. One is Kulaki Mai's Time of Time, Wandering in the Street of Cherry Blossom, which is the first song that made my heart cry especially the lyrics. People are all alone, however, they are always looking for someone else, and constantly pursued all the beauty but fragile. I can say I've heard this song more than 100,000 times, but I've never forget the first time I heard it and crying with deeply sorrow. I also wondered why this song was the only one that had made my heart beating so violently for so many years. It wasn't until years later when I heard Flowers of Miracles that I found out the reason. I'll put link of both songs in the description below, and I'll also put lyric translation in the comments below. A few days ago, when I suddenly fell into a dream, I felt someone behind me, and I turned around, I saw a samurai standing in the corridor. He looked at me with a smile and say to me with a little helplessly voice. Now it is a word of the pain. Who was he? Who was I? As I was writing these words, I certainly thought of the lyrics. If I meet you again in the street with beautiful pink flower, no more hesitation. I will stand by you who is more easily to get hurt than anyone else. This time is forever. 
Thanks for listening and see you next time. Bye bye.